Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for June 25th of 2022, well, it is titled Planets of the Solar System. So what do we see here? Well, here is an image that shows all eight planets in the solar system and our own moon. Now, of course, we see our own Earth in the foreground, or at least the portion of it here from this image taken in Italy. And we can see up in the sky a number of objects, and they're labeled here uh, in Italian, but you can still see the different names. And we see off to the left hand side Mercurio for Mercury, which is the closest planet to the sun and very faint and hard to see because it's always very close to the sun and only visible at certain times just before sunrise or just after sunset. Venere. Uh, up above is planet Venus and that is one of the brighter objects in the sky very easy to see in the morning sky right now right before sunrise and as we continue to track the path up we see Urano or Uranus up higher and next to Luna our moon and then further up towards the middle of the image is Marte which is the red planet Mars and Giove which would be Jupiter, the largest planet in the solar system. And finally, the last two, Netuno, the furthest planet out from the sun, and Saturno, which is all the way up there, the great ringed planet all the way out. Now we'll notice that they follow pretty much a line in the sky and that is because the solar system is flat. So when we look at it from inside from our Earth or from any other planet, the sun, moon and planets will all seem to take the same path in the sky. So when we look at them, we can trace out that path which we call the ecliptic. So that would be the path of the uh, planets would take. Now you'll see that it's not a perfect line and that's because the planets are uh, inclined. Their orbits are tilted a little bit relative to Earth's orbit around the sun. So some of them could be a little bit above or a little bit below. But you can imagine a pretty good line there covering through these covering through these uh, objects in the objects in the solar system. And again, we see eight of them there, seven planets, plus our moon visible in the sky. So this is kind of what you can see in the early morning sky right now, this taken just a day ago, showing all of the planets here in one image uh, from Mercury uh, through uh, Neptune, and of course, our own Earth in the foreground. So that was our picture of the day for June 25th of 2022. It was titled Planets of the Solar System. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.